medium difficulty question, I will classify the question as a GMAT 650 to 700 level problem solving question in sequences and series, concept tested, geometric progression broadly and within that specifically we are looking at some of the first n terms of a geometric progression. If you know the formula to compute the first n terms, right, some of the some first n terms of a geometric progression, then this question is a very straightforward simple question. Knowing that formula is what makes this question a medium difficulty question. If the ratio of the sum of the first 6 terms of a GP to the sum of the first 3 terms of a GP is 9, the ratio between the sum of the first 6 and the sum of the first 3 terms of a geometric progression is 9. What is asked is what is the common ratio of this geometric progression? Step 1, let us first find out what is the formula, the formula to compute the first n terms of a geometric progression, we will call it Sn is equal to A which is the first term times R raised to the power of n minus 1 divided by R minus 1. Some of the first 6 terms, some of the first 3 terms, that ratio is equal to 9, S6, some of the first 6 terms will be A into R raised to the power of 6 minus 1 divided by R minus 1. S3, some of the first 3 terms is A into R cube minus 1 divided by R minus 1 because n is equal to 3, n is equal to 6. A is the first term, R is the common ratio, we need to find out the common ratio. They are saying S6 is to S3 is a 9 is to 1 which essentially means that S6 upon S3 will be equal to a 9. Therefore, the right hand side also this component divided by this expression is equal to a 9. A gets cancelled with A r minus 1 in both the denominators will get cancelled. So, what we have is r raised to the power of 6 minus 1 divided by r cube minus 1 is equal to 9. r raised to the power of 6 minus 1 can be thought of as r raised to the power of 6 minus 1 raised to the power of 6. So, we can write this as r cube whole square minus 1 cube whole square divided by r cube minus 1, this is equal to a 9. Look at it, x square minus y square divided by x minus y is what we have. x square minus y square is an x plus y into x minus y. So, this is r cube plus 1 into r cube minus 1 divided by r cube minus 1, that is equal to a 9. r cube minus 1 gets cancelled with r cube minus 1, translating to r cube plus 1 is equal to a 9. r cube plus 1 is equal to 9, r cube is equal to 8, r is equal to 2. The common ratio of this geometric progression is a 2. Let's look at the answer options. 2 is choice C. Choice C is the correct answer to the question.